Hey honeys, it's your boy Jeremiah back again with another video. And in today's video, I'll be reacting to Road Trip covering Zanny by Billie Eilish. Now, I previously reacted to Road Trip, which I'll link in the card above if you want to check that out. And I think those boys are amazing. I think they're very talented. I've said this time and time again. And I'm also reacting to Billie Eilish, which I will also link in the card above for the first time ever. And she surprised me a bit because I've heard some of her music, but I didn't really hear anything of that genre. And it was nice to hear something different for her change. When it comes to Road Trip, they have lost a member. They've lost Jack. But recently in the new year, they also introduced the new trialist Harper. I believe this is the first video that Harper is in. And after the one, they just said, you know, he's a great fit. Let's put him in. So I'm definitely excited to watch this and see what he brings to the group. But before we get to this video, make sure you like this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that bell icon for notifications when I post. I post every week. Not every two weeks. Not every three weeks. Every seven days or less, honey. And without further ado, let's get into the video. What is it about them? I must be missing something. That's Harper. I think I know the names too, y'all. <laughs> Are they drinking milk? Better off without them. They're nothing but unstable. That's sunny. Bring ashtrays to the table. And that's about the only thing they share. I mean, that's Andy. That's right. What the fuck? And that's Brooklyn. Or Brooke or whatever. Wow. I'm not gonna lie, the lyrics are beautiful. But I don't know yet. I'm not convinced. I don't know why I said beautiful to describe the lyrics. They're real. Okay, so I'm going to be 100% honest with this one. To me, the song was a little bit boring. And I know it's not their song. Of course, it's a cover. I guess there's only so much they can really do to it to keep it like sounding the same and keep it recognizable. That's just one of the main things that I had noticed. I think the lyrics are real. They're raw. They're very relatable. And I think that's kind of what Billie Eilish is all about, to be quite honest. I haven't seen the original song or the visual, if there was one for Billie Eilish. But basing their visual on this, I think their visual was pretty good. I don't know if the visual for them matched the song, but I think there were some components 
that were very cohesive. I think the fact that they were sitting at a table gambling and playing cards and drinking and, you know, doing all of these activities where people who kind of, I guess, are living their, li living their lives away or trying to live it up do. I think it kind of relates to the song and the lyrics of how people are doing anything to kind of make themselves feel better. So I think that was an amazing choice. The styling was great. I think it was perfect for the video and very cohesive, of course, because it was all the same outfit, to be quite honest. If I were to rate the video, definitely I would give it a 10 out of 10. I think the video was a great video. When it comes to the song, the song doesn't have anything to do with them. So I would give their rendition of the song a 10 out of 10. The original rendition, I mean, the, the song originally sounds a bit boring, to be quite honest, as I had mentioned. When it comes to their rendition of the song, I feel like they kept it, you know, in its creative capacity. So I'll give them a 10 out of 10 for the vocal aspect of it. But that is all for this video, guys. Make sure you like this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that bell icon for notifications when I post. I post every week. Not every two weeks. Not every three weeks. Every seven days or less, honey. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, honeys.